Danny Smith, Danny the Janny from Hamilton Townhouse. And you are? I'm Gretchen. Danny the Janny, Gretchen on reception, I like it. <laughs> You're part of the South Lanarkshire Leisure Contingent. Aye, a few of us are booked in for our jags. Are you looking forward to getting back to work? <sighs> Can't wait, that's been nearly a year. One more Zoom quiz might tip me over the edge. <laughs> Hang on, you're nearly there. <laughs> Take a seat. <laughs> so who else is on the list? Uh, Tina McCafferty. Tina the cleaner from Rutherglen Town Hall. My ears are burning, somebody talking about me. Tina! Daddy, you've been waiting long. 11 months. You know what I mean. Oh, I got here just before you. <laughs> Take a seat, Tina. I bet you never thought you'd be so desperate to get back to your mopping bucket. Oh, totally. And if this vaccine doesn't work, I've got a cupboard full of disinfectant I can swallow. <laughs> Mind to keep your distance, you two. Oh, don't worry. I know where he's been. I says you. Who else is joining us? Uh, let's see, Derek Kyle. DK from EK. Maintenance man at East Kilbride Village Theatre and Art Centre. Alright ladies. <laughs> DK. From EK. Alright ladies. <laughs> Tina, Danny, how are you doing? All the better for seeing you. What a day, eh? Aye, but we'll soon have those buildings buzzing again. Take a seat, Mr Kyle, and remember, social distancing. Oh, no chance of forming my own wee bubble with Tina. <laughs> In your dreams. I've been socially distancing for him long before this virus came along. <laughs> How's the last year been for you, DK? I've been living in my nerves. I mean, I used to have to cough to hide a fart. Now I have to fart to hide a cough. <laughs> 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 uh, so is this everyone? No, we're still waiting on Doris Johnson. Doris from the office. Nan at Memorial Hall, how may I help you? Are you taking the mic up? Doris! Oh my goodness, the gang's all here. Take a seat, Doris, and remember social distancing. <laughs> well, if I'd known DK was coming, I would have brought a tape measure. <laughs> <laughs> Behave. DK, are you sure you haven't got the virus? No, why'd you ask? I thought you'd lost your sense of taste with that Jacob. <laughs> Oh, I get my mask as soon as lockdown started. Did you get PP? Oh, aye, but it cleared up with a wee bit of cream from Boots. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wish you could all see yourselves from up here in your masks. It's like the attack of the J-Claws. <laughs> <laughs> oh, these masks are driving me mad. Who said that? Me. You, not me. Her? Not me. This is ridiculous. Aye, my glasses are steaming up. Oh, but you've always had that effect on me, Doris. Oh, I see lockdown hasn't improved your patter, DK. Right, we're more than two metres apart. We're about to get our second jags. I'm taking my mask down for a wee bit. No, Danny, don't. You think I'm contagious? No, I think you're ugly. <laughs> <laughs> OK, me too. In for a penny. In for a pound. All for one. And one, one for all. all. <sighs> so, Tina, how did you and your man get on during lockdown? Put him on a health kick. I stopped him drinking. How did you do that? I had these bevy. Then I stopped him smoking. How did you do that? I had these fags. Then I stopped him biting his nails. How did you do that? I had these teeth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Danny the Janny, in you go. Wish me luck. Good, Good luck. luck. I'm glad we're getting these jags for free. They're no cheap. There's actually some dodgy ones on sale at the bars. Aye, two quid each, or three for a Pfizer. <laughs> Nobody actually knows where the virus came from. I thought it was the Far East. Oh, Hart Hill's got a lot to answer for. <laughs> Are you sure the vaccine's safe? My next door neighbour says that it's going to implant microchips in our bloodstream so the government can track us. <laughs> well, your next door neighbour doesn't know an elbow from an AstraZeneca. <laughs> <laughs> that was quick. Not into it. 
Tina the cleaner, you're next. Oh, here we go. Roll up my sleeves and got on me. Just like being back at work. I can't believe we haven't seen each other in nearly a year. We should have a big party when we're allowed. Can I come too? Of course. The only rules are BYOB. Bring your own booze. And BYOF. Bring your own face mask. Oh yes, everyone must wear a mask and be dipped in bleach. <laughs> Just a normal Friday night for DK. <laughs> All right, ladies. <laughs> I can't wait to get back to normal. Get all our venues open. Get all the events back on. And all the folk back in. I'll be at the front of the queue. It's a stand-up comedy, I miss. Aye, because you've got to laugh, haven't you? I mean, where would we be without a laugh? Wish all! Oof, I always wanted to be a comedian. What happened? Just couldn't stand folk laughing at me. Blah, blah, blah. Well, I wanted to learn how to woo the woman with a romantic verse. So I went to the poetry classes at the art centre. Oh, let's hear your stuff. The women want to meet DK. They come from far and wide. Cos I'm the local Romeo, the stud of East Kilbride. Oh, forget Rabbi Burns. You should be barred. He is barred from every pub in town. Ta-da! I feel like Wonder Woman. And I think you look like her. God loves a tryer, DK. No problems. No, total scoosh, didn't feel a thing. DK from EK, you're next. That light at the end of the tunnel's getting closer by the second. We were just chatting about all the things we miss in the venues. Last year, I booked a weekend of meditation. A weekend? I've had medication for years and I still get the hot flushes. Meditation, not medication. Yoga, mindfulness, well-being. I love the functions, the weddings and stuff. At the townhouse, we do the full shebang. The service at four, the meal at five, the speeches at six, the slosh at seven, and the big fight in the police at eight till late. <laughs> I mean, last year we had a 21st at the town hall and the birthday boy proposed to his girlfriend in the traditional Rutherglen fashion. He took her home, gazed into her eyes and whispered the immortal words, you're wet. <laughs> I signed up for some Latin dance classes. Oh, I, me too. Oh, but I couldn't do the flamenco. I was too constipated. Constipated? Aye. I couldn't even pass a dope. <laughs> <laughs> I went to that class too. And the instructor says to me, you ever done the boss an over? What did you say? I said, no. But I've done the boss a favour a couple of times. <laughs> <laughs> That's me done. Any of you girls want to self-isolate with me? That's all right, ladies. Thank you, but no. Once a super spreader. Doris from the office next. Oh. Last but certainly not least. <laughs> Here, as a punter, what do you miss most about the venues? I miss all the music. Rock, jazz, traditional, but mostly classical. I love Puccini, Rossini and Toscanini. I prefer Panini, Linguini and Tortellini. <laughs> <laughs> and all those tribute bands. Remember last year we had that UB40 tribute band, WD40? They were a bit rusty at first, but they soon loosened up. <laughs> I love all the live shows beamed up onto the big screen. What who? Well, last year Andre Rue was streaming at Memorial Hall. Well, shouldn't I have been drinking before he went on stage? <laughs> streaming, not steaming. <laughs> and I love all those... Classic movies you screen. I could watch them again and again and again. Oh, me too. I'm sure I mind some of the belters I seen last year. Last time I went was with a gorgeous lassie, but I ended up in the lavvy for the whole film. <laughs> We'd been for a curry first, and I thought I was in for a serious bout of Tropic Thunder. Snogging in the back row, but my guts were rotten, and suddenly she was gone with the wind. Not too chuffed when I ran to the gents to do a Scooby Doo. Ah, uh... Boris Gump. Ah, chitty chitty bang bang. Let's just say the outcome was cloudy with a chance of meatballs. That she gave me the bum's rush. You took your time. Well, Dr Proctor was going on about how much he misses the musicals at our venues. But to be honest, one can't beat seeing them in the West End or Broadway. Last year, I saw Hamilton in Chicago and it was marvellous. Well, last year, I saw Chicago in Hamilton and it was mince. Anyway, that's me being done. That's us all being done. Ready to get back to work and open up the venues. And get all that stuff on that we've all missed. What have you guys missed most of all? Panto! Oh, some people say it won't be back this year. Oh, yes, it will. And what will that mean for the pandemic? It's behind you! Sounds like there's something for everyone. <laughs>
There is. And everyone's welcome. We're all for inclusion, equality and diversity. Even if you come from Bothwell. So, Lanark Memorial Hall. EK Village Theatre and Art Centre. Rutherglen Town Hall. And Hamilton Townhouse. Here, Here we come! come. <laughs>